Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Clamper Gaming here. In today's video, I present you guys Classified V2. Hmm. <laughs> yes, we got Classified V2 right here. And I have Classified the first tell as well. I'll be trying out this new one and then comparing it with this, the old design, the old formula. This is a new formula. They have changed it. GFU has mentioned that they changed it. It's a different, whole new experience. Probably a little similar to the first one, but we'll find out in this video together. I'll be having half a uh, shaker with this and, and full shaker with Classified V2. But the new design is looking better than the first one. The first one was a bit bland, but this one is better. Give you guys a nice, good look at it. We have classified V2 right here, the G Philo, Gamma Low, you know, the mystery, magnifying glass for on um, papers, folders, you know, classified V2 right there. The green tilt kind of color on the G Philo outline in the back, and not the back in the bottom. Dog tags, a nice green military background, loop around. Very nice. I love this better than the first one. I'll give you guys a good look on the first one as well. This is the first one, all black. You can just see numbers like hacking or the matrix. All black, nothing too crazy. Just outlines as well. Uh, to be honest, the uh, first, the second one is better in the design, but is the flavor better than the first one? We'll find out. Yeah, I gotta crack this open. You know, we got a mystery in our hands, us. We got a mystery in our hands. All right, leave that side. I'm gonna give it a good smell. Oh, damn, powder got all over my hand and pants. Let's give it a smell. Oh, that's a strong smell. Yo. Oh, that smell though. That smells so good. Especially that it is coconut. Oh, damn. It smells like coconut and cookies. That's what it smells like. I know that smell. I'm gonna, I am eat like coconut cookies sometimes, and I know that smell. I know that smell very well. Oh, that's so good. That smell just raised up the ratings already. <laughs> let's, give smell, let's give this first one a smell. Yeah, you get a sweet smell in the first tub, but nothing else. You don't really get much of anything else, just a sweet, sweet smell. And the second one, the newest one, you get a coconut cookies and that smell. Ooh, that smells so good. Ah, I just fell in love with that smell. Mm. Okay, let me try to find the scooper, get a shaker, fill that up. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I got two clear shakers. Well, one clear shaker for the new flavor and a non-clear one for the classified V1, the first one. Cause then I get confused of which is which. All right, let's start with the classified V2. I'm excited. That smell was so good. Like, I hope the flavor is good as the smell. Coconut. Oh, I love coconut a lot. Okay. Got a good scoop there. Now let's get the old scoop. It's classified B1. Half the scoop, actually. Let me shake both of these up, and I'll be right back again. All right, I'm back. I got classified V2 right here. A pink color scheme compared to the first one. I can't see because it's not a clear shaker, but it's, just, it's a pink color scheme. Or let me open this up and see. See it for myself. Yeah, pink color scheme as well. S same color scheme, but let's see the smell on both of these. Let's give the classified V2 a smell first. Ooh. That smell changed. It smells a lot like watermelon. A sour watermelon. Holy! It reminds me of um, those Sour Patch Kids, the watermelon one. Yeah, and as well at the same time, it smells like 
those um Hispanic watermelon spiced pilates pops. That's two different combinations. Two different smells. S smell the V, the first one, the V one. Well, you get a sweet, sweet smell. Sweet smell like type of dessert or candy. Yeah, that's different. That is different smell. This the class five V one smells sweet. The class five V two smells like a fruit, a spicy or sour fruit. Skiff classified V2 is taste. Does not taste what it smells like. Except for the watermelon. Does taste watermelon. Mm hmm. Watermelon. The more that I'm tasting it, the more it tastes exactly like the watermelon sour patch kids. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. You get that watermelon, then it transitions to a sweet sour. Not very sour, but mainly a sweet. And, and it just mixed together. It reminds me a lot like a sweet. Those sour patch kits the watermelon ones it might be a lot like that exactly like that I'm not gonna lie yeah you get that watermelon that watermelon is a lot in there I think classified v1 is more of a mystery than v2 I think we just found out what v2 is the flavor sour patch kit the watermelon one because you get it's, that's all you pretty much get. You don't get no s spicy, you don't get no sour, you don't get um, a mixture of another fruit in there or sweet dessert or something. You get a watermelon sour patch kit. That's all you get. The texture is exactly like the sour patch kit watermelon one. Whew. We just found out what classified V2 is. Whoo! Oh. Mmm, balanced out too. I love that. Very balanced. Okay. I love how I love how G Fuel is making their flavors more um more um more smoother, less aggressive. They uh, back then they used to be more stronger, more bitter. Now they're starting to balance them out, making them more smoother to drink for the fans out there. I love that. Very good flavor. Sour Patch Kids for the V2. Let's try out classified V1. Ah, let's see what this tastes like. Mm -hmm. they, yeah, they completely changed the formula for V1 and V2. G Fuel said they completely changed the formula, but I thought it was just a, a lie, you know. I thought they're gonna keep it a little similar, but change a portion of it. But yeah, no, they completely changed the whole thing. V2 is way different than V1. Mm -hmm. You get that sweet texture for V1. But there's another dessert candy, whatever it is in there, that brings out another sweet texture. So it's double sweetness. Does have, doesn't have no fruit like the second one. Not at all. Just a sweet, sweet flavor in there. Yeah. Sweetness. Don't really taste any fruit in there or nothing. Sweetness, like sweet into sweet. And both mixed together brings out a different texture of sweetness. <laughs> it's very good. Class 5v1 is still good. You just, there's just sweet, sweet, sweet. No fruit no nothing else like classified v1 is more of a mystery than classified v2 because classified v2 you know exactly what it tastes like v1 it just loops around like say it's sweet and then sweet and then sweet <laughs> i don't have nothing else to talk about for v1 just a sweet texture and oh balanced down some way balanced down some way and 
if you're wondering if it's bitter or strong, no, it's not. It's very in between balanced style as well, like the second one. Just like the mixture, it's just a sweet and sweet of the texture, and that you can get the sweet and the watermelon and sweet, like you know, combination. This one's just a loop around, that one just like one, two, one, and this is just one, 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 one to loop around, even though there's probably two types of sweet it's in there. Yeah, if I have to say which one's the sweetest out of class 5v1 or v2. Class 5v1 is a bit more sweeter than v2. But if I had to say if there's like a fruit in there or different combination, v2. But both flavors are sweet. v2 has a fruit in it, v1 doesn't. v2 is a, um, you can you can exactly find out what it is, what it tastes like, and the texture and everything. v2. v2 is less of a mystery, v1 is more of a mystery because there's like two sweets in there, I don't even know how many, and it's just a mystery. But yeah, overall, both of them, not bad at all. Especially V2, Sour Patch Kids. Ooh, that's busting right there. Never thought g Field would do something like this. What do I rate V1 first? Let's rate V1 first. Well, I rate V1. An update review. I, I know I've done a review on V1 in my channel, but this will be an update review, an update rating. 8.6 out of 10 for classified V1, 8.6 out of 10. And V2, a 9.4 out of 10, a 9.4 out of 10. Classified V2 had a higher rating because I, I found out what the flavor is right away, what the texture tastes like, what it reminds me of. It was less of a mystery and I just love that texture, Sour Patch Kids. That's a good flavor. Never thought GFO would actually do a Sour Patch Kids flavor with a watermelon one. Just imagine the originals. Ooh, that was straight up. Go out. Ooh, I can be my flavor. If I get sponsored in the future, I can be my flavor, you know? But yeah, 8.6 with class 5v1, class 5v2, 9.4 out of 10. Very good flavors for both ends. Love them both. Don't hate them at all. Don't hate them. But that's all on to this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you on the next one, my friends. Peace out.